diaphragm call, mouth call, whatever you want to call it, this one here goes into your mouth, open and out, okay? And then the longest of the reeds would be on the top, okay? So you just put it on your tongue, push it to the roof of your mouth, and just start trying to get some air. Just blow. So like I say, just push it up tight against the roof of your mouth and you're just blowing air. And you know what? There's a lot of people that are intimidated by these calls and they think they're going to choke and gag. And, but the more practice that you have, um, you're going to just find that these things are really, really the key. Because the advantage to a mouth call is just being hands-free. So you're sitting up against your tree, both hands on the gun, both hands on the bow, whatever it may be, and you can still make a sound to bring that bird in an extra, you know, 5, 10, 15 yards, whatever you need, by just... So, like I say, you're just going to have to practice. So keep some of these in your truck or in your car and practice on your way to and from work. If you practice in your home, you're going to drive your husband nuts or your wife nuts or your kids nuts because these are really annoying. But if you can get to learn how to use a diaphragm call, you're going to be a more successful turkey hunter. Each one of them, you know, is different. This one um, is, I believe, a triple reed. Some of them are double reeds, some have different cuts. You know, you're just going to get different tones, pitches, and volume. So you hear that? A little rasp beer. Diaphragm calls are are the key. They might be the hardest call to master, and I've yet to master them. I mean, I'm, I'm decent, but um, if you can just get some sound that sounds like a turkey, because all turkeys sound different, if you can just get something out of a mouth call, you are going to have an advantage. Just because, like I say, now you're not tied up down here using your slate call when you should be holding your gun. So um, I would suggest you pick up you know, maybe a multi-pack of diaphragm calls and just practice. And you're just going to be that much more successful in the field. So good luck this spring.